Now, the third and final imperative that I want to talk about to you, that I think is particularly important for companies that do work primarily business to business, as well as companies that work in the core of people's businesses, and that principle is to go beyond the experience. To go beyond the experience. Why? Well, because experiences can be commoditized just as easily as services and goods. In fact, experiences may be the easiest economic offering to customize. Because the second time you have an experience, it's not going to be as good as the first. Third time is not going to be as good as that, and pretty soon your customers are saying, been there, done that. That's the hallmark of a commoditized experience. So using this same heuristic that we have where customization is the antidote to commoditization, what happens when you customize an experience? What happens when you design an experience that is so engaging? That's exactly the experience that some person or some company needs right now. Then you can't help but turn it into what we often call a life-transforming experience. In other words, an experience that changes us in some way, and I call that a transformation. A transformation is the fifth and final economic offering, this progression of economic value, where you guide your customers to change. You guide your customers to change. Many businesses are naturally in the transformation business. Think about fitness centers. Why do people go to fitness centers and endure all that work, sweat, and pain? Because they think the gain will be worth it. They want to become more fit. Why do people go to psychiatrists and pay over $100 an hour only to be asked, well, what do you think? Because <laughs> they think they will become better in some way. Why do people spend tens of thousands of dollars going back to business school? Right? Think about it. Is it for the ideas they get, the commodities of the business school environment? Is it for all those wonderful books they get to read, the goods? Is it for the homework analysis, the services? Is it for the classroom experience? No. What do they want? They want to be transformed. They want different skills, different capabilities, different knowledge, a different career, different earning potential. They want to be a different person as a result of that business school environment. One business school that recognizes that is the London Business School, where the former dean, John Quelch, told Fast Company that we're not in the education business, we're in the transformation business. We expect everyone who participates in the program at the London Business School, whether it's for three days or for two years, to be transformed by the experience. Right? With a transformation, the customer is the product. Think about that. The customer is the product. doesn't matter all that stuff you do. doesn't matter what goods they buy, what services, what experience. The question is, did the customer achieve their aspiration? That's the key with the transformation.